Understanding interest rates can be an important step in taking control of your finances. Start with the basics. Interest is simply the cost of borrowing money, and it's a two-way street. If you borrow, like charging a vacation on your credit card or getting a car loan, the interest goes from you to the financial institution. That's you paying interest. If you put money into savings or other interest-bearing accounts, you are essentially lending that money to the bank and they pay savings interest to you. That's you earning interest. So how do interest rates work? A lot goes into it, but interest pretty much works the same whether you're borrowing or investing. The big difference is if you're paying or earning. Okay, but what is annual interest rate? That's the rate of interest paid over a year. It's a percentage, generally shown as APR for loans and APY for deposits, and it varies based on different factors. So how does APR work? APR, or your annual percentage rate, is your yearly rate on money borrowed calculated using simple interest. APY, or annual percentage yield, on the other hand, is your yearly rate on money deposited calculated using compound or simple interest. Simple interest is a steady climb. It's calculated as a percentage of the principal, the amount borrowed or deposited, over a certain time period. The percentage doesn't change and is always calculated on the original amount. Compound interest occurs when interest that stays in your account is added to the existing balance. The interest rate is then calculated on this new balance for the next time period, which can be daily, monthly, yearly, and so on. It's interest on interest and climbs higher and faster as time goes on. So what does all this mean for you and your money? It means that even a small interest rate change can make a difference, especially with compound interest. With a lower rate on a big loan, you could pay significantly less over the life of the loan. With a higher rate on a big investment, you could potentially earn a lot more. Whether you're borrowing or investing, understanding interest rates could make for a much smoother financial road ahead. What's in your wallet?